Hello and welcome! In today's video we will show you how properly and safely perform the initial charge. In order to do so, we are going to use LRX 110 ampere hour cells. We choose this battery pack because of its low weight, small size and high energy density. The other components that we are going to need are cell connectors, abrasive sponge and initial charger. Don't worry! All links to the products used in this video can be found in the description. Unpack the cells from the box. Measure the polarity, find out the voltage. Use an abrasive sponge to clean terminals and connectors. The terminals on top of the batteries are made from aluminum and copper, which over time builds up an oxide layer when exposed to air. Removing the oxide layer will greatly improve conduction and minimize transient resistance at the terminal and is a prerequisite for the proper functioning of the pack and the preservation of the warranty. Align the cells in parallel by putting positive and negative poles to each other and connect the cells with connectors. Don't connect the charger only to the first cell. This could cause that the pack wouldn't be evenly charged. Connect the initiation charger to the first and last cell and plug it into the power supply. Wait until the LED light indicates that the battery is fully charged. The charger then turns itself off automatically. Remove the connectors and disassemble the whole pack. The assembly that we have shown you today is best suited for example for energy storage, solar applications, RVs and caravan or boats. But it's not entirely suitable for use in electromobility. You should immediately attach a protective BMS such as a BMS 1 to 3 or LRX CPM with a disconnector to the pack, otherwise you are no longer eligible for the cell warranty. We hope you found this video useful. Thank you for watching and for more information about our products, please feel free to visit our eShop.